Hey guys, I'm with you and uh, I was busy with the last two days. I was traveling to Mumbai for the Oppo's launch, which was the F1 smartphone. They launched a new smartphone called as Oppo F1 at a price of 15,000 rupees, which is a selfie centric smartphone. Again, that comes with 720p display and not that great specifications, but that's something which the brand is focusing only on the selfie part. They also announced a F1 plus smartphone, which should be coming in the month of March. So we don't have much details about that. Right now, we have two new smartphones. One is this uh, Swipe Virtue and the Mathon M5 Lite. I'll be doing an unboxing back to back in this single video and uh, let's talk about the same. The first phone which we are doing an unboxing of is the Swipes Virtue which is a budget centric smartphone. It comes with a 1.3 GHz quad core processor and a 5 inches HD IPS display, 2 GB of RAM and 16 GB of internal storage. Now this is the phone which also comes with a 5 megapixel front camera and an 8 megapixel rear camera. A very budget centric smartphone. I wonder uh, who would be really interested in these kind of devices but that's what swipe is actually offering you and uh, in terms of design again i have been liking their designs a little bit but this looks like a uh, xiaomi's uh, mi4 clone from a simple view that's what this phone is about so that's the swipe vir virtue on the back you have the swipe and the virtue logo with the speaker rules on the bottom on the top you have this 8 megapixel camera with the led flash on the right you have the volume rockers and the on off switch on the left there is nothing, on the bottom you have the, the back panel opening swap and a microphone while on the top you have the micro USB port and the 3.5 headset jack. Let's open up the back panel and uh, show you what else comes inside. So here you have the slot to insert the battery and it says this is the color is the white silver and you also have this uh, IMI numbers. You have the dual SIM card slot options here and uh, that's it which is what we get. Talking about the other aspects of this package, what we get here is this uh, uh, very simple uh, earphones. You have this micro USB cable, uh, travel adapter and this battery. So here is the battery which has a capacity of 2500 mAh and that's what goes into this phone. You also have this uh, reading manual and this warranty card. Along with this you have this uh, simple silicon case for this smartphone. Let's boot up the phone and take you directly to the screen. So that's it, we are onto the home screen. Let's skip all these options and directly take you to the home screen. So let's quickly proceed all these options. And here is the beautiful wallpaper on the home screen which is pretty much impressing me. And here under the app drawer you have a bunch of different applications which come pre-installed. So let's quickly go back to the app drawer and show you what all comes here. So there are these applications which are like backup and reset. You have this clean master, CM browser, file manager and then uh, you have the flash player, hangama, quicker. So there's a lot of uh, bloatware which comes pre-installed. Let me just quickly check if I can uninstall the same and yes I am able to uninstall the same. Which is again good in a way. I mean that's how these brands would actually make some money and uh, obviously offer the phones at a discounted pricing or a very competitive pricing at least. And that's a good way that at least they offer you to uninstall these applications. Now let me just go to the settings under about and here you can notice that the phone is running on Android 5.1. That's Lollipop. Let's go back and check out the storage on this device. So here the device comes with an 16 GB of storage out of which around 11.72 GB is available which is pretty good. I mean you cannot complain much about the same. Talking about the camera, the device comes with an 8 megapixel camera. Let me quickly capture a photo and show you the camera quality. So here is a quick capture which was done with this phone and it's not that impressive. It does look like an 5 megapixel capture but that's what it offers you with and this is the swipe virtue smartphone overall this is the phone let me know if you what are your thoughts about this one let us do the unboxing of the second phone of the day which we have here that's the geonis marathon m5 Lite. so geoni had uh, launched their smartphone in china and uh, this is the lighter variant which has been uh, launched here in india at a price of 13,909 rupees let's open up the package and show you what all comes pre-installed onto this package itself. So within the package you have this pair of earphones, you have this micro USB cable and then this Geoni branded travel adapter 
next up you have this uh, user guide and a uh, warranty statement or the warranty card and a screen guard so this is all what you get within the package now let's take a look on the phone itself so here is the phone let me just remove this uh, screen guard and this is the phone it looks pretty good at least the fact that it's a battery centric smartphone and this is the phone i mean it does look uh, pretty good in terms of the color and the build which you get here again this is a plastic based phone and on the back you have the geony branding with the led camera and flash for the camera and the speaker grills on the bottom on the right you have the volume rockers and the on off switch while on the left you have nothing and then on the bottom you have the micro usb cable slot and the microphone on the top you have the 3.5 headset jack and uh, on the front you have the front camera so here we have done a quick boot and here is what you get so you can notice that there are a bunch of folders here which have all the applications and again as in the earlier device itself you can notice that there are a lot, lot of pre-installed applications and that's what we call them as bloatwares and yes you can again uninstall them which is a pretty good thing so that's what you can do let me just try to uninstall a few of these applications and uh, then check out the internal storage which you get because i don't really want all these device applications to be available on my phone all the time so here under the about phone area you can notice that the device also again runs on the android lollipop which is 5.1 and talking about the internal storage which is 16 gb let's check out the available storage which is again available under advanced settings and here you can notice that the device actually does not have a 16 gb storage but this one has a storage of 32 gb and the available storage is around 24 gb which is 23.63 which is pretty good enough i do feel that this is a little bit laggy or as such but we'll try to check that out under the settings but this is what the brand offers you with the best part is that the device comes at a price of 13,000 rupees and uh, still it comes with a 32 GB of internal storage and a 3 GB of RAM. Let me quickly show you the camera. While I capture a photo with this camera which is an 8 megapixel sensor, you can notice that uh, the picture is pretty sharp when compared to the same 8 megapixel which we had seen on the Swipe Virtue which came out to be of very bad quality. This one is definitely of a very... Uh, at least a better quality when compared to what we had seen in the earlier device and the best feature of this device is it comes with a 4000 mAh of battery capacity which should easily last you for a day or maybe one and a half day and that's what Geony offers you on the Geony's uh, Mathon M5 Lite so these were the unboxings of the day and uh, that's it for the day we don't have any more announcements for today so stay tuned on phonera.com for more updates on what's happening on the tech today that's it for the day. Don't forget to add a thumbs up and stay subscribed to Fonda for more videos like this. Thank you.